Hello everyone, thank you for tuning in to the Burn Lot here, coming to you straight from the sunny land of Portugal. The topic of today's video is, once again, Cataclysm Dark Days Ahead. We are going to have a small divergence in the way that we approach this kind of thing. Namely, I'm trying not to flip out, namely, we are going to do something different. We are not, we will not be reading any books. We'll be keeping books for the sake of recipes, but we will be increasing our skills through practice. We will be having uh, uh, random NPCs and not static NPCs. We will be having construction of a home anywhere that is possible, rather than in a ranch, as was planned. We are going to have scaled construction. We are going to have zero skills. And... We're still going to start in a house surrounded by zombies in the middle of nowhere. So, let us begin, shall we? This is going to go absolutely wonderful, isn't it? I don't know why I did this ridiculously dramatic opening. All I know is I have to take a, uh, a paracetamol pill in about ten minutes, so uh, there's that. Okay. First off, and I start next to a lockpick kit. Locksmith kit. Huh. Alright. Let's see. No, I don't need a bra. I could use a blanket, so I'll take that. Start with duct tape. That's also cool. That's interesting. I can actually go this direction. Okay, so I'm assuming that there's... There's nothing here. Okay. So let's take, 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 take the wind, take the curtains. Take the curtains. And I'll, I'll, I'll take the uh, long string. Thank you very much. And I'm going to make a sl two sl Sling, sling, thank you. Two slingshots, not slingshots, slings. There we go. Let's tear down the curtains as well. Thank you. What the hell? I forgot. I forgot to put. I forgot to put on my headphones. I'm an idiot. All right, headphones on. There we go. No, I don't need a sling pack. I don't need popcorn kernels. Hold on, so each sling gives me 30C. This one gives me 40C, but for less encumbrance. Ah, fuck it, I'll keep the slings. I'm gonna just drop them. Let's see, beer. I'll take the frying pan. Um, yeasts and marshmallows. Huh. Yeah, no thank you. I'll take the yeasts for later. Not a lot of stuff in terms of... Oh, fuck. No thank you. Ooh. I spoke too soon. Hard cheese, dried rice, meat soup, dark cola, pickled meats, lemon lime soda. Alright. Alright, buddy. Come here. Come here. Right here. Right this way. Or not. Okay. No. Close it. Close the door. Can I pick the guns? And there's nothing in here. Thank you so much. Alright, let's close that. Thank you very much. Is there anything I can take here? What's a transistor? I'll take the books purely for the recipes. Control combustion fundamentals. A game watch. A waterproof digital watch with built-in electronic game system powered by standard batteries activate the play. Oh, and it does give me the time. Oh, nice! I can use that to take the time. Fantastic. Okay, now I know what time it is. Computer gaming. No thank you. Anything I can take here. Uh, cough syrup. I uh, might use it. I don't know. Alright, so, okay, let's... Everything is done. Let's head out, and hopefully, when we head to this particular shelter... Also, by the way... I'll have a couple more mods in. I don't. I don't believe I had the filthy clothing thing. Clothing thing. I think I did. But I'm not sure. I also have PK's reimagining, and because of that, I also have crazy, crazy cataclysm. So there's that. And of course, dirty clothes. I still don't have uh, stats through skills, even though I very much like it. <gasps> Gas mask. Thank you. I'll take the emergency jacket as well. Also, I'll I'll, I'll, I'll take the folded emergency blanket because it's more practical. And I can put on the emergency jacket, I can put on the gas mask. I absolutely love gas masks. I don't know why, I really do. And you know why I love gas masks? 
because it makes boomers and bloated zombies a joke. And of course, absolutely nothing here. <sighs> Every time I go to a fucking shelter, there's nothing in the shelter. It pisses me the fuck off, I swear. Dear, no, thank you. Oh boy, this is not good. Can I make a crowbar? A crow? A makeshift crowbar? Where the hell did you come from? All right. Wait, 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 wait. Run in, run in, run in, run in, run. Oh boy. Oh, this isn't good. This isn't good. Okay, so let me see. The rock has bash seven. The frying pan has bash ten. And to hit bonus, plus two. So, I'm gonna die anyway. But I can at least die... Killing zombies with a frying pan. So, you know what? Where did you come from? I can't... Okay, where did the fuck did you come from? You weren't there when I came towards the fucking... Oh my god. Uh... Where were you? You weren't there! The second zombie wasn't there! Also, alright, I have the slings on. Right, and cumbrans and all that. Alright. See, all it takes is the game gives the game gives me a little bit of a thing. The game gives me something. Oh, fuck you. See, this is what I'm talking about. The game hates me. This is unfair. It is. The game gives me one little good start, and because I make one mistake, I die. And because of that, the game says, well, you had your fucking try. Fuck you. You're going to start you in the middle of a fucking city. Why? The game doesn't want me to survive. I swear to Christ. Well, it's time to start fucking house diving now, isn't it? Let's make f fucking slings and not fight at all ever. Let's just not fight at all. Let's just go ahead and uh, house dive and not produce anything. Let's just go ahead and steal shit. What? A wolf suit. I'm uh, a bit more partial to lynxes, thank you very much. But you know, if you like wolves, that's that's your thing. Also, one thing I never really realized: Do you sell powdered eggs in bottles? That is really weird to me. How the fuck do you sell powdered eggs in bottles? Yeah. Alright, steak knife. This is good. I have stuff now. I'll take the umbrella. No, thank you. Radio. I don't need the radio. But I'll take it anyway, because I can dismantle it later. Let's see. Coffee powder. No, thank you. A tactical handgun digest. I think this might have some interesting recipes for me to use later. Bon appetit. Same here. Let's see. Pair of socks. What the fuck is this? A go bag. Oh. Interesting. I'm pretty sure that a go bag has various useful things, especially a gun. So hold on, if I disassemble the go bag, two minutes. Okay, so this has a sleeping bag, a pocket knife, a lighter, a flashlight, some batteries, a roll mat. Oh my god. Let's okay, let's wear the tactical gloves. Uh, let's uh, put some batteries in the flashlight. Here plugs, well thank you. Fire gauntlets. Rubber gloves, socks, sneakers, combat boots. So I can take away my sneakers and I can wear some combat boots. Thank you. A rain hood, a rain coat. I can take both. A rain hood and a rain coat. I can take both. A chest rig. I can wear the ch Take the chest rig. I can wear the chest rig for more volume. Kevlar vest, compression top, army pants, an army jacket as well. Do I have anything on my outer? I don't think so. So I can put on my arm. I can take off my. I can take off my shorts, no pants, and I can wear my army jacket, and I can wear my army pants. And now I can put on my army helmet, and I see something here, which is a duffel bag, which means I can wear the duffel bag. I don't have to make a duffel bag. Fantastic! This is amazing. I have everything I can use now. Unfortunately, now, I actually have to change the thing. Okay, hold on. The problem I have I had in these last recordings is that the uh, advanced inventory management has been set to the exact... Oh. Oh, really? 
The add local key binding thing is also my recording button. Fuck my life. Okay, I'll take a five second break so I can just change something and I'll explain what it is. I'll be right back. Alright. Advanced inventory management. This is where you can sort out the layers in your clothing. So we're going to go to a torso and let's make sure that everything is right. So the chest rig goes over the t-shirt, the army jacket goes in over the chest rig, and the duffel bag goes under the army jacket. The head is fine, mouth, left arm, left arm, right arm, left hands. Everything seems to be fine. Yeah, okay, everything's fine. Okay, I just wanted to make sure that the duffel bag was inside. I have a lot of stuff. Can I make anything? I can make a nail board, I think. Or not. I can make a cudgel. A pointy stick. Huh. Okay, so the two hit bonus of the cudgel is plus two, but only has bash eight. The pointy stick has bash four and pierce eight. But only a two hit bonus of one. I'll take the pointy stick. Alright, now I have plenty of things to use. And I'm also in the middle of a fucking city, crawling with zombies. So there's also that fucking problem. I can take a soldering iron though, that's amazing. Oh boy. Nope, not going in there. Let's see. This is Money Bundle, uh, Paladin, Playboy, uh, pff, Swashbuckling, no thank you, I don't need any of this. No. Where's the kitchen? There's that kitchen. Italian seasoning, Master of Molasses. I, can I, oh, I can use it to make the Lux luxury, luxury Beans. Okay, Cabbage, Irradiated Melons, Long string, and I'm not even going to try to fight. I'm just going to close the door. And I'm going to burst open the fucking window. And I'm going to run over to the next fucking house. And then I'm going to close the... Oh, come on, really? No, fuck you. Oh, come on. <sighs> Fine. I'll put out the fucking duffel bag. And now my encumbrance should be minimal. Oh, listen to that fucking sling. Oh, I love that sound. I close that. Uh, take the take the duffel bag and go back into this and put the duffel bag under the army jacket. S smash this motherfucking corpse. T oh! Dried beans, beans, condensed milk, batter fried fish, lasagna, pieces of bacon, dehydrated fish, a spoon, some canned pineapple, fast noodles, and spaghetti. Let's slave this. There's gonna be something behind that door, isn't there? Oh, no. Okay. Sewing kit. Uh, lye powder. No, thank you. I don't need this yet. Okay, so I want to go down here. <laughs> I want to get the fuck out of the city so I can go from this house that I'm at to this house and then this house, hopefully. But first, oh fuck me, no no no, no no no, okay, drop the duffel bag again, alright, come at me bro, there we go, the only thing damaged is the pointy stick, okay, ignore, I ignore, thank you. I don't get the point. Why I say ignore the thing. Why aren't you? Okay, let's pick up the pulp zombie corpse and drop it over here so we can close the door. Really? Really? Ignore the things. Okay, let's drop the things here. There we go. Ignore the things. Okay. Ignore. ignore. Okay, my stamina is up and up again. Let's go to advanced inventory management, put the duffel bag under the army jacket again. Everything seems to be fine. Ooh, that's a lot of shit. Clean water. I can, I can take all of this. Jesus, stop. When I tell you ignore, just ignore it. Cucina Italiana, I'll take that as well. Because Cucina Italiana allows me to make lasagna and shit like that. So I'll take that, thank you very much. Do I have a wrench? No. So I'll take the wrench... Oh, that is not No, 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 run. Run, 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 run,
Oh, really? A fucking spider house. You're gonna give me a spider house. With giant cellar spiders. Wow, thank you. At least I, oh, at least I think the spiders actually managed to distract the zombies. Thank fuck. Ooh. Nah, I have everything. I have everything I need. Are you? Are you serious? No. Fuck you. Oh fuck me. Seriously? Okay. 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 I can do this, I think. I think I can lose them in the trees. Assuming that nothing worse gets to me. Oh fuck, that's a moose. Shit. Okay, hold on, hold on. I can do this. I can do this. There's a field down there. It can't be all bad. Okay, hold on. What's here? That's a black rat. Okay, I think I... I think I lost them. Okay. I lost the zombies. I managed to loot so much shit. Okay, let's wheel a pointy stick. Okay, I have a pointy stick. Can I use this to make anything? That bindle. Oh, wow. Okay. I have a pot, steak knife, wrench, sewing kit, soldering iron, roll mat, radio, lighters, and flashlight. I have plenty of food and water, uh, Bon Appetit, Cucina Italiana, and Tactical Handgun Digest. Does this actually have any, any recipes I can use? Uh, iron Sights, Offset, Flintlock Pistol, eh, whatever. Oh, come on! Really? Really? Oh, fuck you! Seriously? I evade... Fuck you! I'm gonna die, aren't I? I'm gonna hate you, game. I really am. Yeah, you run off! You fucking coward! Oh my fucking god. Oh, come on! Go away! Go Ugh, fuck! I swear to God, I managed to evade everything else. And then the moose decides, oh, you know that guy I didn't aggro on? Like, fuck. I will kill you, cougar. I will kill you, if you dare. Do not dare! Yeah, you run off. This is why I say the game is unfair. Because the game blatantly breaks its own rules half the time. It's like, oh, remember that fucking thing that didn't aggro on you when you passed by fucking five inches away from it? Let's have it aggro you. Now. When you're a mile away. Thank you. And now I have an infected leg. Why? This is why I say the game. This is why I save scum at times. This is why I save scum. Because the game is blatantly breaking its own rules. Let's just change the way that aggro works. Oh, thank you. At least the fucking infection went away. I need to get to the fucking road. It changed the way that aggro worked. I, I went by the moose, like five inches away from it, and it did nothing. Then suddenly, from half a mile away, it just randomly decides to aggro on me. Why? Why did it do that? Also, fucking ants! Why ants? And a factory, of course. Fuck me. No, don't aggro on me. Great. And, uh, why? Of course the path I take, out of all the paths possible, is the one that has a fucking anthill. Why? The game hates me. It does. I know this for a fact. The game just fucking hates my guts. It's the only explanation I have. And of course the ants are not all aggroed. Why? Fuck knows. They just randomly aggro on things. Fucking hell. I shouldn't have come here. I shouldn't have come here. But hell, 
sunk cost fallacy. I bit two. No, I can't. I can't go. I can't. I can't keep going this way. I know perfectly well if I go this way, I'll just end up fucking myself over. Can I make a splint? No. I'll know I'll fuck myself over because I am in no condition to fight anything. And all the ants are aggroed. Why? Who knows? They just are. Something happened and now every single fucking ant in the fucking region is pissed off. Why? Who knows? Certainly not your fault. The game just decided, yeah, let's let's make the let's make this hard for the sake of being hard. Fuck me. <sighs> let's go to the field, shall we? Let's go in the exact opposite direction of the fucking ant hill. And of course, there's soldier ants all the way here because the game just wants you to die. This is what is this what crazy cataclysm is? The game is just randomly five times harder. Yeah, that's. Top-notch design, right there. Jesus, fuck. Back into the field. God damn. At least the fucking ants aren't aggroed here. Why are there ants here? Is there another anthill? I'll kick your ass, game, if there's another fucking handhill. Because I'm seeing fuck-tons of ants everywhere, and I don't like it. Jesus. Go away, ants. No one likes you. Also, I'm gonna have to handle a fucking broken arm for God's know how long because the moose randomly decided to aggro on me. And my t-shirt and is torn and my army jacket is torn. I god uh, oy vey. Oy vey. Oh, and there's a swamp. Of course there is. The game has decided to not give me- You know what, fuck you. I am determined to win. I am determined to survive. And it ain't gonna be your shitty attempts at killing me that are going to stop me from surviving. Also, I forgot to eat. Oh, Jesus. I forgot to eat. I was so pissed off, I forgot to eat. Okay. Uh, where's my water? Two plastic bottles of water. Clean water. <sighs> okay. Do I have any medication? I don't think so. No. And then gonna be your shitty attempts at killing me that are going to stop me from being determined to win. I will win this. And of course the game decides, oh let's also give you one of those super populated swamps as well. Well, fuck you. You ain't getting the best of me. Oh, I accidentally clicked outside the game window again. This is why I, d I don't even know if this has, does that, does this have a full screen? I think this has a full screen thing, but the full screen just destroys the aspect ratio completely. Also, I'm not going in that fucking swamp. And I need to find some, there's a road there, maybe I can find, I don't know, a car? I hope I can find a car because the day is ending and I, as you can see, as it, mouse there, as you can see here, the sun is beginning to set. And I don't like that, because I'm in the middle of fucking nowhere with no shelter. Mm -hmm. Come on, come on, come on! Well, it's a random road. There should be something here. Any cars? Any anything? Hello, hello Bubsy. Any, any anything? Where's the moose? Is the moose here? Antlered horror! I don't even know what that thing is, but I'm not going in that direction. Thank you very much. God, there's nothing in the fucking... There has to be something in the road! Anything? Anything at all! I'll take a fucking motorcycle, I'll sleep on... I'll, I have a sleeping bag, I'll like put a fucking sleeping bag on the fucking... I'll put a sleeping bag on the, I don't know, what do I want to call it, the seat? Oh uh, yeah, you, yeah, you, you, you come here, come here. Yeah, you, you go fuck yourself. Goddamn coyotes. Come on, over here. Yeah, that's fucking right. Really? Is the coyote and the dog going to team up on me? Go, 
go fuck your you heavily injured. Yeah, you, you better run. This is not simulate wildlife properly. Unless the fucking cougar is starving and almost dead, it most certainly will not continue chasing a prey that is killing it very efficient, see? Otherwise this happens. Where the fuck did that come from? See, the cougar runs off. What the fuck is that? That's something. Oh my god! It's a fort! What the shit is this? Metal tank? What is this? What's it called? A bandit bulldozer. The door's locked. Can I use a locksmith? Oh, I don't have a locksmith kit, right. I don't know if I should break down the door, but... Oh my god! This is amazing! A bandit fort. There's so much stuff. Well, I don't know if there's so much stuff here. Uh, there's nails, battery. There's even a, there, there, there's a there's a I can use this as a bed. There's a bathroom. What's this? Half a male quarterly. Oh my god! Cheeseburgers. Anything here? Peanut butter sandwiches, cranberry juice, pieces of bacon, radiated apple, raw macaroni, canned pineapple, plastic bag of dry beans. Uh, a wood saw. I'll take the wood saw. Wood saw is very useful. Oh my god. I found a random fort. A kukri. Thank you. I'll take the kukri. Those of you who don't know, kukri is what the sniper in TF2 uses. It's a, Nepal it's, it's a Nepalese weapon characterized by us. Uh, an inverted blade uh, that curves towards the arm as opposed to away from it. It's amazing to, for clearing out uh, pathways in uh, dense uh, forested areas, whatever. Tin plate, uh, ravioli, pesto. Anything here? A Ruger, 12-gauge uh, pistol, nothing else. I do have a Kukri. That's something. I can use that. Whoa! The fuck? So I'm assuming this thing has mines protecting it. Okay. Huh. So, in my time of need... Please tell me, that, does, does, does this have any sort of... Nah, it doesn't. Does the bandit bulldozer have anything? Bad... Oh, but no battery. Ah, fuck. Whatever. In my time of need, the game provided... A fort. I'm alive. Thank you all for tuning in. I hope you guys and gals had a great time. As always, I'm open to suggestions in the comment section down below. And on next we meet, this is Tully B. Burnlot, signing off. Goodbye.